Good morning guys Today I will have a quite short session Hoping only for some asp. I have a little bit more than two hours almost three of fishing and uh, For that to to be as fast as I can I took with me two roads so I can change some different lures hoping to find again some uh, good ones <laughs> for the yes let's say that my expectations are quite high considering the spot that i'm fishing today and uh, let's hope i just need to move as stealth as i can be so that's why i will put my lures on from here so in this case I don't need to make any noise when I'm reaching uh, the spot <laughs> that I hope that the ass will be there in this case I will go for the RH lure on this one and on the other one I'll just go with the salmon trail. In this case, I can alternate faster the roads and the lures, hoping to find the good one. Now, let's go to the fishing spot. So I won't spook any of them. And I will go with the salmon tree. So this will be the first cast for today. Yeah, and was a good one. <laughs> That's a great way to start the day. I need to push this fish because I have this. Okay, it's not one of those big guys but I just need to be very careful as I move in here because come on here man yeah that's great I will just take my pliers so I can release him as fast as I can came on the salmon tree and it's a good asp I won't make any photo but have a look thanks a lot buddy Yep. This piece of wood, definitely it's not okay to have it there, but come on here, man. I just don't know how to fish that spot. No, everything is so slippery in here. 
It's full of mud. Shit. <laughs> I think that this guy is a little bit bigger than the previous one. Yeah, this one, it's already a good asp. Have a look. Oh, thanks a lot, buddy. Are you ready? Thank you. Yeah. No, I no, I haven't. Uh, no, he's coming to me with the current, and now he got stuck under that tree. Come on, man! I don't want you to break my line. I just need to move from where I'm fishing because otherwise there's a big chance of losing some fish in that tree come on here I will just take this guy like this so it's easier for me to unhook him Thanks a lot, buddy. Ooh, okay. Yeah, Whew. that was a good one. That was a big asp. No, again. Yeah. No, don't go there. No, don't go there. I'm here. No way. He got stuck under that tree in there. No. I don't want to spook all my fish. This wasn't good. All those rocks. Come on here, man. Oh. So the first fish of the year on a top water lure. In this case, 
was a Sammy that finally I think that got his first fish and it's a good ass oh, thanks a lot buddy yeah I just no it got off I switched to Salmo Trail because after all those rocks drop off I think that I spooked all of them big guy definitely that thing was big yeah man you will be free in just a few seconds I just switched as I said to Salmo Trail because after I made all that noise with all those rocks for some reason they just hunt a little bit lower so I will go back to the top water in 10 minutes. Are you ready, man? Thank you. I think that there are a little bit more than 20 minutes that I'm fishing without seeing any fish, without getting any bite or anything. I think that they know that I'm here and they just uh, hunt in a different spot. So right now I will move from here, I will go on the other side and uh, hope that they will be back and I will be back in around 30 minutes perhaps. At least that was a hit after 40 minutes of feeling nothing. Just got off. <laughs> that was nice. Yeah, no. Whew, finally, and I lost it. is not right with my reel I think that I will have to open it no don't go there I think that I will have to open my reel and see what's going on because every time that I here we go I was saying that every time that I'm trying to push a little bit harder to make some strange noises and it's not okay at all. Oh, come on. Yeah, 
this guy wanted a salmon trill and he really took the lure quite bad. Here we go. I'll just make a quick photo with this guy. It's, it's quite a nice fish. Okay, buddy. Now it's time to put you back in. Thanks a lot. <laughs> yeah, no way. Why I'm losing all this fish? It almost feels like they are not really eating. They are there, but they are not eating. No, the trebles are okay, so I don't know. No. Why? They are biting in a strange way. Yeah! Whoa. <laughs> this was a nice one! And I'm quite sure that it will be a big ass. I just need to be careful. Because I have this big tree on my right, this big current that is not helping me. No, don't go there, don't go there! Oh. Come on. Come on here, man. Whoa, that's a big ass. Whew, I'm quite sure that this is the biggest ass caught so far this year. Whoa, that's a big guy. Come on here, man. You are amazing. Whoa, yes. This is a big fish. Whew. Thanks a lot, buddy. And again, the heat came on the Salmo trail. Whoa, amazing. Okay, big guy, are you ready? Thank you, <laughs> thanks a lot. <laughs> I think that there are more than 20 minutes since I caught uh, that huge asp and even though I have tried, I simply cannot uh, fish anymore. I, I just keep relieving uh, that, that heat, the fight, uh, everything. It was just amazing and I can say that I got really, really lucky because I have this tree here and uh, he didn't got stuck under that tree. I I just made a small sign on my road and I will I will go home and uh, check the length but I'm quite sure that uh, this will be my new personal best. My previous PB for the asp was uh, 88 centimeters and I'm quite sure that this guy was over 90. I will check the length and I will just uh, write a message down below on this video. Anyhow, right now I will go home. I just had the uh, perfect ending couldn't go any any better than this and uh, right now i'm extremely happy hope that you two guys uh, enjoy this session this video in this case if you do 
hit that like button, drop me a comment down below that will help uh, the channel grow and uh, even consider to subscribe if you want to see more of these videos in the future. So thanks guys for watching and uh, see you in the next one. Bye bye.